TV always has a way of adapting to the times and making it clear how they want to give people more of what they want. After the movie Crazy Rich Asians came out, there was a desire to go and see more of the lives of these Asian families who are very much wealthy and live extravagant lives. Netflix did this with their show Singapore Social and Bling Empire, but HBO Max did it in a more focused sense via House of Ho, which has left many wondering whether it'll get a second season and what will be in it. Allow us to show you 6 things you need to expect from House of Ho Season 2. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Number 6. The House of Ho So if you don't know about this series, here's an overview for you. House of Ho, the multi-generational family docu-soap, chronicles the daily lives of Patriarch Bin Ho, Matriarch Hugh Ho, and their daughter Judy Ho, their son Washington Ho, and his wife Leslie Ho, and Tina and cousin Sammy. Power couple Bin and his wife Hugh immigrated from Vietnam to the United States with little money, relying on hard work to establish the ultimate American dream. They have built a multi-million dollar bank, a real estate development company, and a new generation of American hoes. The series pulls back the curtains on their lavish Houston lifestyle and showcases the tight family connections that unite them, as well as the multi-generational outrageous drama that ensues. So, very much a Crazy Rich Asians feel with some Texas flair thrown in for the effect. The show is definitely something to behold, especially as the reality show drama sets in. As of yet, HBO Max hasn't renewed the show, but that doesn't mean it's cancelled. The platform is still very much growing and learning how to market and build up its shows. So what happens next to them is a bit of a mystery on some fronts. Number 5. The Reactions as you would expect, a show like this is very much dependent on its viewer base, especially on a new platform like HBO Max, which is no doubt analyzing every single success and failure they have to ensure that they keep the good things and dump the bad ones. While some potential viewers are excited about seeing more Asian faces in the predominantly white reality TV landscape, finally, a Viet reality show I can watch with my Viet parents, one commenter wrote on the show's trailer. Others have critiqued the focus of the series, Y'all telling me Vietnamese people are finally getting media representation and what they gave us is Trump supporter Kardashian wannabes? I'm so embarrassed for us," wrote one Twitter user. This is so very unfamiliar to me. Not gonna watch it," wrote another commenter on YouTube. In her review for the AV Club, Priyanka Bose also pointed out that viewers looking for an entertaining romp may be disappointed by the overall messaging and tone of House of Ho. The series is less about clashing values within different equally outspoken generations than it is an uncomfortable glimpse into how traditional patriarchal structures continue to make the lives of women absolutely miserable, even in the wealthiest of families," she wrote. It's bleak and disheartening to watch Judy and Leslie bend over backwards to fulfill their duties as members of the family and never measure up. That's not exactly the warmest of reviews, but it is something that raises a good question. Number 4. Could Controversy Get It Renewed? Here's the thing, whether we want to admit it or not, television thrives on certain things, and controversy is absolutely one of them. Just look at Fox News and their programming, or for something closer to House of Ho, go look at Keeping Up with the Kardashians. <laughs> oh yeah, we're going there. This is a show that's very much painted the whole family as snobs, jerks, idiots, and manipulators not to mention being incredibly vain and not caring about others as long as they come off looking great and making money while doing it. That show has lasted for over 15 years and is only now about to get cancelled. That goes to show you how controversy can create cash. If HBO Max wants to, they could not just renew House of Ho, but frame the next season even more on this more negative side of the family in order not just to get viewers, but stir up conversations. TV shows and movies absolutely have the ability to create change or start topics of change, and certain people who watched the show did indicate that this is a good snapshot of the upper echelon of Asian culture in terms of power rankings, how women are treated, and so on. If HBO Max thinks they can get attention on themselves and the program by showing this off, they'll do it. Number 3. Closer as a Family you actually have to wonder if shows like House of Ho do more harm than good to the families that are being showcased. Sure, with the Kardashians, you know that they don't care, and they're just more worried about their fame and money. But House of Ho is honestly a little different, in that they're just trying to be their normal family self, as they're being filmed. 
which is why it may surprise you to learn that, according to them, they're actually closer together as a family because of the show. During a recent Q&A, Judy, her brother Washington, and his wife Leslie were asked if they learned anything new about each other from working on House of Ho. Judy immediately jumped in, jokingly giving her brother a hard time. Well, I didn't learn anything new about Washington. She then more seriously talked about how the experience brought her and her sister-in-law Leslie closer together, due in part to Judy living with Leslie and Washington early on in the series. Leslie echoed this sentiment, saying, I met Fun Judy. I love Fun Judy. Washington recalls Leslie singing Judy's praises to him. When Judy, uh, moved into our house and then, you know, after a month or two, my wife would come into our room like, you know your sister, she's real cool. I go, I told you that a long time ago. Washington also talked about how Judy living with them helped him to better understand his wife Leslie. He recognized some of the feelings Judy was having while going through her divorce and his own wife and didn't want that to be the case. I think we're a lot closer and a lot more comfortable around each other. And, you know, I understand how my sister felt because when she moved into my home, I started having these visions like, I think my wife kind of feels the same way. And remember the talk about gender inequality that the show played out in full? Washington actually thinks that's a good thing for the Vietnamese people. We were talking about gender bias, right? I see a lot of culture of the old school way and I hope that this show inspires other people that it's okay to let your wife lead the way because, you know, in our culture you got, you do business, you got money, it's kind of like a known fact over history that the man is allowed to go networking and, you know, and do what he wants and the lady is there taking care of the kids. So I hope that a lot of the females learn from my wife and my sister that it's okay to, you know, cut it off and not have to suffer for the rest of your life. Number two, a kind of therapy. In season one, Washington and Leslie had a rather strained relationship and though it got better, it wasn't easy. Yet for Leslie, she felt the show honestly helped her as it revealed to her own family how things were going. My family before the show was not aware of any issues we were having. You know, they live a state away, so I never wanted to bother them. And I guess also as a daughter of an immigrant parent, you don't want to disappoint them, right? So that I didn't want to share any of that with them. And so this will be the first time they're seeing it firsthand. So my mom knows a little bit, but I don't think she knows the full extent. Washington said it was therapeutic to have everything happen on the show as it did, because it brought him and his wife closer together. Number one. The Future of House of Ho So as noted, at present the second season of House of Ho isn't renewed. But if it does, the second season is likely going to double down harder on what season 1 set up for the show. The family dynamics are going to be tested even more than before. And we might even get a deeper look into the personalities and styles and traits that this very rich family has. With shows like these, you can always expect drama and things not to go as planned. But what happens next? That might be up to them and HBO Max. So what do you think? What do you think of this look at the potential for House of Ho Season 2 and how it all might go down should it get renewed? Do you think HBO Max will continue the series? Are you a fan that is hoping for that to happen? What would you personally like to see if the show goes on? Let us know in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe and we'll see you next time on the channel.